morning you guys welcome back to another video today is wednesday 9 30 in the morning look at me waking up out early hot breath hold on it is so cold outside it is 25 degrees right now i just walked from the house into my car it's not even that long of a walk but i'm like freaking panting right now i don't know why okay maybe i'm just nervous you guys make me nervous okay we just dropped off omar at daycare it's his first time at daycare he used to go to like a family friend's house but now he's actually staying at an actual daycare but anyways welcome and welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is kennedy welcome so in my channel i post a lot about self-improvement how to become your best self with a little bit of fitness and beauty and all the good stuff in it as well so if you're interested in those type of topics then go ahead and follow i wouldn't mind you know so we can all learn to become our best self so for this vlog i'm going to be showing you guys what i'm going to be doing today that includes making my vision board planning out my goals for this year just try to be productive for the day i have a lot planned for this year i'm gonna show you guys all of that in this video so keep on watching i'm gonna do a little reflection for the past year so last year was actually such a learning year for me i educated myself a lot on how to become my best self i read a lot of books about self-improvement and with that being said that is why i kind of want to share what i've read and what i've learned with you guys that's why i started post more videos about self-improvement how to attract your blessings 2023 is such a learning year for me it was a lot of uh, up and down as well like we move out of our apartment we just moved back to darren's parents house because we are building a house building a house is freaking expensive but the process though we are really grateful we get to see the process and everything is just such a blessing kind of lost some friends and it sucks when you lose friends and like the friendships that you have with like these people that you've been friends with for years and years it's sad at times but you have to think everything in a positive way i've learned that losing friendship is actually a really beautiful thing because it signals evolution it means that you're growing you're evolving you're changing you're not the same person as before some people they stay stagnant they don't move forward this year we're not going to force anybody to be in our life this is the thing though if somebody wants to do something they're gonna do it i feel like i'm being redirected to a path that i'm supposed to be going on and i know that the path i'm going on right now it's the right path because i feel more free and i feel like i'm not constantly trying to please somebody trying to force somebody to be friends with me to love me you never know on this new path that you're on somebody that's meant to be in your life will come what if that person think the same thing about you you know so yeah 2023 is definitely a learning year for me and i can't wait to learn so much more in 2024 <laughs>
guys so i just finished eating my breakfast I took a shower and got ready i'm gonna tell you guys what is going to be on my vision board and then i'm gonna take it to a place to get it printed out some of the things that i want to achieve for this year is food so as you guys can see i want to start eating better i eat decently good but for this year i wanted to eat a lot better i usually meal plan anyways but i just wanted to incorporate more foods more meal plans this year we're gonna try to cook a lot more than just the food that i always cook i'm gonna try to learn a lot more recipes to make and you know just have a variety of different kind of foods for my body and then i have a lot of quotes that resonates a lot with me and i want to put those quotes into my vision board as well so that i can see it and then i read it and it motivates me this one says a little progress each day adds up to big results there's different quotes as you can see and then i have self-care i want to take care of myself a lot more this year and i have this one guys i'm pretty sure you guys are going to ask like what is that so big news your girl just finished her personal training course so I'm officially certified personal trainer but as of right now I'm not getting a job just yet because I have formal courses I need to complete I got my personal training certificate but I'm also working on my nutrition course my HIIT training course strength and conditioning and also bodybuilding so whenever I complete all those courses your girl about to start training people but i wanted to start with myself first to make sure that i look good because you're not gonna attract no clients if you don't look the part you know what i mean and then i have also a lot more different things obviously i want to read more books i want to get at least 10k subscribers by the end of this year so hopefully that's gonna happen but obviously i have to put in the work and be more consistent with my content i mean i post like every month that's not consistent you know so that's another goal that i have just you know really really work on my youtube and you know and i love love filming youtube and now omari is in daycare i don't have no excuse so i'm gonna hold myself accountable for that this year and if i'm not posting at least once a week y'all better get on my ass okay one last thing i want to show you guys is this one this is like a house and we already have our house it is being built right now but i hope we get it finished soon this year i also want that to be on my vision board as well all right y'all so i just walked into walmart and i totally forgot to record because i was rushing in i was holding my computer because all of the pictures is on my computer i just put it on the microsoft so they're all in like one page like three pictures four pictures in one page so i have like 20 pages and i walked into walmart and they're telling me that they don't print just regular paper pictures they print like picture pictures where like the paper is thick so that's not what i wanted and it would be more expensive so i don't know where to print my pictures we're gonna figure it out but um i got my vision board it has flowers in the middle but it's gonna be covers so and i also got some glue and scissors so yeah all right guys so i just gotta print it out i had to go to the ups this is like a book it's got like almost 20 pages i think it's like 19 pages i'm so excited to put them on my vision board y'all so yeah i finally figured it out it took me like an hour so we're in the time crunch now crunch time crunch we're in a time crunch now so i'm gonna hurry up and go home and start doing this because i have a lot to talk to you guys about so all right so i'm finally home i have all the stuff that i need to make for my vision board bring forward she's kind of big but we're gonna do it like sideways it's just like cuter this way i think before we start i just wanted to tell you guys about one thing that I've been doing and that is reading. I've been reading a lot of books lately. I read this book, it's called The 12 Week Year. I highly recommend you guys go read this book. So this book is pretty much about get more done in 12 weeks than others do in 12 months. You should be using your time wisely 
Time is honestly the most important and most valuable asset that we have. We cannot take time for granted. Look at all the stuff that I have highlighted on this book, like this whole book. All the things that are really important and I just wanted to remember like when I go back to look at the book again. I cannot wait to implement this book into this year. This book has taught me how to achieve my goals in a different way. Some of the goals that I have for myself, I never get to achieve it because I don't use my time wisely. This book is actually teaching you how to split your time into 12 weeks. Every 12 weeks is a year so you split the whole 12 months in, into quarterly but I'm gonna talk about this book a lot more maybe in my next video. I'm going to plan out all my goals and I'm gonna show you guys the whole process pretty much in the next video so stay tuned we're already talking about goals and stuff so i downloaded this app it's called meat plus i paid 20 dollars for a whole year which is like not bad okay, so this is the app meat plus and as you can see this is today's to-do list for me i have ready for read for 30 minutes before bed journal going to the gym i achieve that after you achieve it you just click the little circle right there and it just cross out that task for the day and I have to make appointment doctor appointment for Omari and I need to get started on editing and I need to film YouTube which I am filming right now so I can cross that out and then I gotta fold Omari's clothes. I started since Friday and it's actually really fun and it's making me more motivated and disciplined to get what I need to do each day. So say Saturday, I crossed out all my to-do list. So yeah, it just reminds you of what you need to do for the day. There's so many distractions, so many things going on in your life. You kind of forget what you needed to do for that day. So it's like a daily reminder as well. So if you guys wanted to make your day a lot easier to remember like all the tasks that you need to do in a day, then download the app. It's actually really helpful. I started writing on my journal again. I got two. So this one is just like a five minute gratitude journal. So you have like the morning time and then the nighttime one. So I do this in the morning and then I do this part at night. So just like a daily reflection on what I did and what I'm grateful for for the day. But for this one, I actually write my thoughts in there, like things that I... Okay, kitty, you're in my shop. This notebook, I just use it to write down all my thoughts, like stuff about like what I'm going through. Sometimes I don't really want to talk about it. I just write it down. Okay, of course, kitty is going to be in the way. Wow, I actually have this clear part. I can actually put all my pictures there without getting it dirty or damaged. $5, y'all, at Walmart. Go get you one. Later. I just cut out all the pictures. They are literally all over the place. Probably like 50, 60 pictures. So I kind of organized them out in a little piles. Um, these are all the words and then like money and house, and reading, self care, you know, getting closer to God, fitness, and then eating healthier, personal training, um, YouTube career traveling right here and also some luxurious things and you know more traveling this one goes right here so now since i have them all sorted out and i'm just gonna go ahead and place them onto the board
y'all so this is my vision board she's so cute so now i'm gonna talk about what i have on here i have youtube i'm trying to be more consistent with youtube i literally edited my name right there for a hundred thousand subscribers i don't know if i'm gonna get that this year but you know it doesn't hurt to put on your vision board because you never know and then i have like a lot of quotes 2024 is my year i have like getting closer to god and i have family self-care um, more youtube and traveling reading more books and eating healthier train harder and you know become the best person trainer ever and all these quotes so yeah this is my little vision board i love it i want to write a little letter about all the things that no longer serve me i just wanted to write it down on a piece of paper and after i finish writing them i'm gonna set set it on fire it's kind of like a little reminder for myself that all these things that i wrote down are no longer serving me all these areas of my life is for the past and it's gone i do not want it in my life anymore i'm gonna write it down and then let it go finish my little note and then I'm gonna fold it and I'm gonna take it outside and use my lighter and actually burn it so let's go all right y'all we're outside and I have my piece of paper that I'm going to burn so I'm telling God right now all this is no longer serving me and is not coming with me in 2024 so we're gonna destroy it completely guys it's burning ah <laughs> where is she she's gone i'm inside now it was so cold outside but honestly after doing that i feel kind of good i'm letting go of something already like mentally but you know i have to practice and not bringing all these habits and all these things that are no longer serving me back into my life this is time for you to do as well so that is over now it's time for me to write a letter to my future self i want to tell her what i wanted to do for this year what i mean by future self it means the 2025 kennedy when 2025 comes i'm going to read it to myself and see if i have made my future self proud or not hopefully i do turn on some vibration music let my thoughts go so i'm gonna um do it off camera all right guys i just finished that took forever and darian had to go gail mari because it's five o'clock now that brings us to the end of today's video and if you made it this far that means it is your sign to create your dream life for 2024 so dream big and go for your goals go for your dreams we're gonna make 2024 our year okay we're gonna do this together as always thank you all so much for watching and i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to give me that big thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't i'll see you guys in the next video bye, bye.